first we need to make a copy of these clips. Right click, go to speed and duration, and then just check the reverse speed box. Go to show clip keyframes, and under the timer mapping, check speed. Click this diamond to add a new keyframe. Right in the middle, split the playhead so that it gradually ramps from fast to slow. Press R and just stretch that inward. Create another copy of this. File, new, and let's just select black video. So let's stretch it so it's the same exact length. Let's search for noise. I'll drag that onto the black video. Turn the amount of noise up. Search for an effect called wave warp. Let's change the wave type to sawtooth. Let's make it 180 and let's turn the wave height up until we get a full slit down the middle. Let's increase the width to be much higher. Add one more adjustment layer. Here we're just going to add two quick effects. Noise, but this time we'll keep color noise on and wave warp. Switch it to be smooth noise, 180 degrees. Increase the wave height and wing and we'll select all edges. So that's how to create a glitchy VHS style rewind effect.